Well, many of us saw hazy and smoky skies, including in this picture. You can see some of the gray haziness seen off in the distance. Very light, but you could still pick it out there. And you'll never believe how far this was taken. This was 80 miles away from Rockton, where that fire had started. And even getting a little closer to home, look at this gorgeous sunset that we saw again with that fire in the distance, which has been the scene for a lot of us this afternoon. And as we look at satellite and radar, we can see we have stayed quiet, fairly dry, some very light clouds moving in from the north. Some spotty showers were picked up on radar off into the east off of Milwaukee. But like I said, we will end up staying dry and none of those rain showers will end up developing for our area. As far as temperatures today, we made it into the upper 80s here in Rockford, 88 degrees, a little bit cooler down south, lower 80s for Rochelle and DeKalb, a little bit warmer over in Savannah. And that's going to be the trend for going into this week. We're not going to be seeing much of those 90 degree temperatures like we saw over the weekend. And even for tonight, we're going to be dropping a little bit cooler into the 60s, upper 50s in some locations. A few clouds will be building it, but we will stay fairly dry. And as for tomorrow, those 80s will return. Sunny skies will start your day and we, we will have a pleasant breeze as well. Winds will shift slightly out of the north northeast, gusting up to 20 miles an hour. Now, if you're going to be waking up with that first cup of coffee, taking you through the morning, we'll see plenty of sunshine, a little bit of clouds here and there, but those temperatures will warm slowly and gradually. Very comfortable, nothing too hot like we've seen in the past week. And if you are heading outside, that UV index will be in the higher range as we will see plenty of sunshine. Going to want to make sure you have some protection against the sun and those allergies will also be in the medium to high range as we aren't seeing any relief from the pollen levels just yet, leaving us with a moderate air quality. As for the rain chances that some of us have been looking for, the next best chance is going to come Thursday evening into the overnight hours for Friday is when we're going to see those chances for some thunderstorms and rain showers. And as we head through the rest of the week, you're going to see very comfortable conditions. As for the midweek, plenty of sunshine, a spike in temperatures by the time we get to Thursday and those rain chances come in for the end of the week for Friday morning. And for the weekend, we go back into comfortable conditions and looking at your most active accurate 10 day forecast. We're going to see a couple more rain chances filter in much needed rain, but nonetheless, those temperatures are going to stay fairly comfortable for us here at the state line. And as far as those temperatures, we are so confident in our forecast that we're willing to put some money on it. Today we are kicking off a four degree guarantee. So every day that we are correct, we will put $13 in a pot that will end up uh, piling up as we are. Even on track for tonight, we were up by one degree. The forecast high yesterday was 87 degrees and we made it to 88 degrees. So we're starting off with a total of $13 and every day we're correct. We're going to continue to add $13. And Claudia, you mentioned that fire in Rockton may have actually changed our temperature just a little bit. Still within the, the four degree guarantee, though. Correct. Yes, we actually got pretty lucky. I think if some of that really dense smoke was a little bit further um, south toward Rockford, where we take those official me mm -hmm. measurements at the Rockford Airport, it would have swayed our temperatures a lot more. Um, I was actually very happy to see that the temperatures went a little above what we forecasted. Um, I didn't think we were going to make it there, but we actually did. That sunshine really helped us out despite seeing all of that smoke today. Okay, the start of the cash pot, $13 <laughs> tonight. Yep. Claudia, thank you. Still to come for us, back open.